Your new missions, guys. Okay, well, Seaport is just filled with destinations right now. Let's look in the event. Okay, treasure hunt. So you send your ships everywhere and send a bunch of crew there and you unlock more things and uh, you get some stuff. So just like other treasure hunt from, from previous missions, this one seems to be much bigger though. I'll talk about that afterwards. Um, you also get these small chests or treasures along the way. So when you unlock one, well, when you discover one place, you might have a few options, which I'll show you uh, after this. You can get like three currencies. It's like a bronze, silver, and gold coin. It's just a item, just like the just like trees, or just like wooden horses from the last event. But the balloons is the best one. That's a little shiny gold colored coin. You can trade gems for that. The rest you get resource, I guess, gold or XP. It's okay. Uh, they put some old NPCs just for this event, so I assume that if you have unlocked them, you can, or I'm not sure, but you you'll see some of the old NPCs just for like one mission to get some of the coins, I think, or some other. Uh, you send a bunch of wood. They give you a bronze coin in the beginning. I'll go into that later too. Uh, three ships. There's a Discovery, Enterprise, and Voyager. Two of these ships can be bought with gems. One of them can be bought with normal resource. Now, from if you've watched my previous videos, I have two ships that I've kept that carries 200 crew or sailors, but like five and seven uh cargo respectively that's why you never you don't put this in the museum because it's very useful in these events and i might just get the one with the resource yeah that makes sense okay and i don't think it's very expensive either but i won't know about that until later so this is going to be like a part one of two parts about this event it seems like they're updating events mid duration so like from now to the end of january maybe like 10 days after we're gonna get an update we get more ships and stuff which seems reasonable yeah and it ends of january 31st they changed some tavern captains so let's take a look at that uh the only these are the normal captains i don't know where the rest vaporized the event captains they're just boost crew Basically, except one. But I'm not gonna spend gems. But hey, oh, well, I, I don't know why you want this, but I figured there's gonna be a need for this at some point. Who knows? Okay. <laughs> uh, there's no more snow cover. That that's that's interesting. I'm not. I'm so used to the green now. Now the green actually looks different. But I'm sure it's not different. It's always been there. I just haven't noticed. Okay, let's look at the map. So, so what happened? It started with three locations. There's one here, there's one here, and there's one here. But what, I think it was one here. So what happened was I sent ships here. It took like 200 crew. So I just sent one of my 200 crew ships and then unlock three. After that one, this one completed. And you have to explore again. So it, all of these takes lots of crews. This took like a thousand. I think this took like 400. Uh, this takes... So anyways, you see there's one mission from this guy. You send him like 600 wood and you get like a hundred these bronze brass coins. Whatever they call them. Okay. Then you get this guy. Oh, fast go. Oh, I didn't read that. I missed it. I didn't read. I don't know what's happening. Oh, well. Let's... Discover. Oh, there's this guy. Okay. There's this guy. Ah, now, see, now you get more, a little bit more. So I think this escape keeps repeating. You do one, it splits off into two. It's like splinters off. I don't know. Well, I do know. Because there's the seaportgame.wikia.com. <laughs> so I did Columbus. And then now it's Vasco, and then I'll put Blackbeard. Oh, let me 
make it a bit bigger. So it just goes down the list of NPCs. There's more and more NPCs, and then there's a level 60 requirement. No, level 50 requirement. And not, oh, yeah, there's a 3,000 crew. 700 cloth. Oh, I see why they made it. Make it. Uh, the cloth actually gives you. It doesn't actually deplete now because you need this for these missions. Interesting. So what they basically say is that you need lots of captains, and you also need very good ships. I don't know what's happening to the browser right now. Okay. Um, from what I can tell, wait, what's reward two? This reward one and reward two, bonus. Oh, six hundred, two thousand. That's pretty bad. Thousand. Eh. Okay, you do get you do get these coins, which is okay. Let me take a look. Let me take a look. Coins. Oh, let me choose. If I had to choose one, I would choose between these two for the, this little re, re, real. I, I bet it's not real. Real de Valon. Don't quote me on this. I, I am not a language major in any way, shape, or form. Uh, I would pick. Uh, these are pretty even. I'll I'll say pick the one that you want more. If you want to level more, yeah. If you're if you're if you're dying for wood, pick wood. Fish, no. Uh, uh, between the silver, pe that's probably Spanish. Peso de ocho. I have, I have no idea. Iron. Okay, definitely not stone. Pick iron. XP or iron. Uh, I'll say. I think just like pick the one you want. I'm a little bit more uh, biased towards iron. Yeah, I'm a little bit more biased to iron because if, if these two are basically the same to you, I'll say pick iron. Yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> People that you shouldn't listen to, people who just question themselves <laughs> what, to, what to say when they're making a video. So if I get 100 for this, if I get 110 for this versus that, yeah, I'll say pick iron. Yeah, definitely iron. Yeah, yeah, pick iron over this unless you you just have too much iron, which is it's a matter. It's it's only a question of when do you run out of iron, not so much of uh, when do I need to level up more. For this, I think I'm just going for gems, just cause, not because uh, five thousand gold. <laughs> That's nothing. This is actually pretty good. So I guess it comes back down to if you really want gems, take gems. If you don't care about gems, pick XP. Okay, that that solved that solved all of that. Solved all of that. Okay, good, good. Okay, let's click on this. Let's see what happens here. Eight. Oh, okay, treasure chest. Some more, more stuff. I'm not sure I'm not even sure how this event goes because it just like splinters off where this little thing just like linear I don't actually know the how it goes so I'll probably make a video most likely make a second video of, of afterwards when I do understand what's going on but I do want to give you guys uh, my first impression and uh, some of my simple thoughts on how and what I should do especially when this trading your hard-earned coins uh, let's see. Yeah, I'll probably just slowly. Oh, that's. You know what? I when I see all these sailors being used, six thousand. Well, you know what that tells me? That tells me. They're, they're figuring ways to put houses to push us to upgrade houses. I'll tell you that. And houses takes a lot of iron, so you guys are gonna be running out of iron left and right. I'm running out of iron. I'm I'm always broke from iron. I can't. I can't even upgrade this yet because I'm so broke with iron. I've uh, have all the other all the other resources are there, not iron. So iron, and then you need to get these guys in, just to get your crew. Okay, that's just for this video. I'll talk to you guys next time when I have more information. Cheers.